Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So I've seen a major issue in some people playing the bassoon, and so it's called tonguing your notes. So if you guys don't know what that is, it's um so what the new bassoonists intend to do, they intend to between notes they take a they breathe in and then they play the note but it's like the notes are right next to each other and there's no sign for a breath so you guys sometimes will do this you guys will sometimes do that but what you're really supposed to do is you're supposed to tongue the notes and it's supposed to sound like this the airstream is supposed to say stay constant can't play that loud because my sister's on a Zoom call downstairs, so it's going to say loud instrument. Try to play a little bit louder. It's really supposed to sound like that. And so, the way that I like to do it is I like to take, what I used to do, I took the reed off the vocal, and I just brought it up to my height, and I played a deep note, which would be a G. And... I practiced that for like a week or so and I got the hang of it. It it depends. Um sometimes it'll take people a month, sometimes it'll take them an hour. Depends on the person and their skill level. So basically the airstream is supposed to stay constant and like when you see um I can put this. So like when you see um a note. So let's say dreidel dreidel for instance. So you see these notes? There's no sign indicating a breath in between them. There's a sign indicating a breath right here, but not here. So you're just supposed to go these notes with a constant air stream. So just listen to the air of the reed. Never stop the airflow, and then when there's a sign for a breath, you can take a breath and continue. So, if you guys have any questions, comment, I'll answer them, and see you in the next one. Like your bell, cut.